the whole Dave thing was a very long process. In the beginning, first I asked Dave to join the band about the Fold of the Lollapalooza about three years ago. And he said no. He said, I'm busy doing another project with my friend. And we're doing this other project. And I understood because he was loyal to his project. And I was kind of disappointed that I couldn't do it like that. So, um, and then as time passed, I got a call from my lawyer one day and he said, he goes, don't quote me on this, don't tell anybody I told you this, but I think Dave Navarro is unhappy with this thing that he's doing. And he, he, or not so unhappy, but he's looking to do something else. And so I called him up and said, why don't you come over and play with us? And he came over and played with us for five minutes. And then we said, will you join the band? And he said, yes. playing and my playing, our bands are pretty drastically different on an aesthetic level. <coughs> when he joined the band, I think at first I was trying to bend towards what Dave, what I thought Dave would like, and he was trying to bend towards what he thought I would like with the playing. And it took a while before we could just both play the way that we play and find a place where that happens together in a beautiful way. Another, another awkward thing about when I first started playing with them is that um, these guys existed as a band Chad, Flea, and Anthony before I stepped into it. So it wasn't like I was joining, uh, forming a new band. I was joining an existing band where these guys all had a musical relationship and an emotional relationship. And I kind of had to step in and hopefully try and connect musically and emotionally. And um, that's difficult to do.